All right, Mr. JT at Denver Lake, catching up with you. It's been a few years since your days at Oakmont. We'll start off there first. Uh, when you look back at that time, great run for you guys. Uh, some good memories. Uh, great memories, honestly. I mean, playing with Tony Gill, guys like Fred Mobley, Matt Daly, Alex Ford. We had a great team back then, I feel like. And even the coaching staff, too. It was just it was great group of guys, and it was a great a great experience to put for me to play in. Um, I mean, I've, I've seen Tony. I haven't seen Tony maybe maybe a year now. Actually, no, I saw him. Maybe last month, but I haven't seen a lot of those guys in a long time now. So it's, it's it'll be great to see them again. But it was a great group of guys you know, when I was in high school. So, well, let's talk about your time here, redshirt junior. Now um, you're having a great year. Uh, you had an injury though last year. Talk about the injury and was it frustrating for you? Is, and how good is it to be back? Um, yeah, first of all, it was frustrating. Like when I first tore it. I mean, of course, any injury that serious, like to just make you sit out for the entire season, is going to put you under some like stress and like um, pressure. I feel like. So at first I was very frustrated with like myself and like the process of rehab and everything. But as I, as I continue to go through rehab, I realize that it's more of a blessing in disguise. I got an extra year now. And I've I really got to develop my game. I feel like I'm more mature on the court and in the locker room as well in the classroom. So I feel like it was really uh, an opportunity for me to like calm myself and get back to what what I love doing and playing basketball. So I mean I'm not saying I'm glad it happened, but almost I'm looking on the on the bright side of things. We're here at a great academic institution. Uh, I think you said you're a sociology major, is yeah, that correct? W what do you plan to do with that, and, uh, and you, you're going to keep that major? Uh, I mean, well, first, I, I, I want to play basketball for as long as I can. So, with, uh, But with, with my sociology major, I feel like I can go into marketing and management and kind of uh, sort of use my personality to, uh, I mean, get the better of people. Not, not get the better of people, but, I, but I achieve what I want to in, the, in that world. So. Well, let's talk about the team. You guys are playing really well. Had the big win over Long Beach State recently. You guys are just playing fam fabulous. What is unique about this year's team? Why are you guys playing so well? Um, great chemistry this year. Uh, we, we have four leaders in Corey Hawkins, Josh Richards, Tyler Les, and Avery Johnson. And they really kind of take Coach's message that he's been preaching for as long as he's been here. But they take that message and they kind of make it our own. You mean, it's, it's one thing hearing the message from the coach, but it's another thing when you hear it from your people that you can relate to. So I think that's that's what's really changed our team. That's what's really changed our program so far this year. And um, I mean, we, every we come to we come to practice every day. Everyone willing to work, willing to do the things that Coach Les has asked. I mean, I don't. There's there's been no slip ups this year whatsoever. And like with, with things like breakfast check, study hall, everyone's doing what they're supposed to, and they're in the spot at at the time that they need to be. So it's just it, it's it's a working it's a working machine right now. Things are just. We're, we're doing what we do, man. It's, it's lovely. 